Hello everyone, so in this video, let us talk about a medium level problem from lead code. The problem name is find k closest element. So you're given a sorted integer array as you can see and then you have to, you're also given k and x. Return k closest element to the integer x inside the array and the result should be in a sorted ascending order. So closest means that if you're taking any point then on the left hand side or right hand side, whatever distance, the point should be as close to x find those k closest point to x from these uh, positions in the array okay that's the whole problem now it uh, seems very easy now that what you can directly do is that for every element you can just iterate over this whole array and find the distance between x and just sort out the distance and just take the first k elements pretty much simple not too much difficult as in so i don't know why it's says easy and it has a lot of uh, up score but it is very easy so what you can directly do is i can directly move on the code part so what you can do is that we can create a vector of pair storing out the first value as the distance from the x for the current point and the point value itself because in the end we have to return the point value the first k values okay then what we'll do is that the first value is the absolute difference between x and the ith point so array value and then the second is the array value itself then we'll sort these distances and then we have to make an answer vector for the first k value so we will just iterate over the first k value because the distance is sorted by the absolute difference between x and the ith point and thus it is sorted in the smallest to the largest value so the first smallest k values closest to the x value will be stored here and we just push back those values okay so let's say 2 is closest 5 is closest whatever uh, elements are closest to uh, uh, let's say x are stored in this answer vector now the order might be different so you can also sort these values because in the end you have to return a sorted in the ascending value of this particular value so you can just again sort it out so return answer. so this is just uh, a for loop this is sorting so n login again for loop n login so over time obviously is n login uh, we have done two sorting of this distance array and then the answer array which has stored all this point so nothing as difficult as in uh, for this problem but i hope you understand something from this overall problem so that's the whole logic and the code part for this particular problem if you still have any doubts you can mention in the comment box of this particular video thank you for watching the video until the end i will see you in the next one like keep coding and bye